Go outside or look out the window. What can you see, hear, or smell? What have you found, and does it have any significance to your everyday life? For the city that I live in, there are a lot of really, really, really tall buildings. So let's go across the world to a similarly sized city of Kathmandu. Kathmandu is the capital of Nepal and it is the largest city found in the Himalayas. It is a city that is rich in centuries of culture and history. A number of famous landmarks call Kathmandu their home, including Jirbar Square, Swayambunath, Budanath, and Pashupatinath. A fifth landmark, which at one time was also the tallest building in Kathmandu, is called the Darahara Tower. The Darahara Tower has taken a few different forms since it was originally built. Its first form was built in 1832 by Bimsen Thapa for the Queen Maharani Lalit Tripura Sundari. It was an architectural marvel that stood 11 stories high. However, a year later, an earthquake broke through the region and damaged part of the tower. Restoration began quickly and brought the tower back to its original glory. The tower stood tall over the city for a hundred years, when in 1934 another earthquake struck. All but the bottom four stories of the Darahara were destroyed. The tower was built again and completed in 1936, where it then stood at nine stories tall. Then almost 80 years passed before the devastating earthquake of 2015 tore through the city. The Darahara, among many other buildings, were destroyed, and more than 9,000 people were killed. The loss was felt through the city, the country, and the world. A year later, it was announced that a replica of the tower along with a memorial park would be built next to the ruins of the previous structure. In 2021, construction was completed and an inauguration ceremony was held. Our lives will always be influenced by our surroundings, whether they change or remain the same. What can we learn about other cultures from their surroundings?